happening. As local Catholics mourn his loss, they are also taking time to remember Bishop Emeritus John Darcy. He died yesterday of a rare cancer. News Channel 15's Lamar Holiday talked to a couple of people who knew him personally. And Lamar's in Studio 15 with more on how the bishop impacted our community. Mark and Heather Darcy served the Fort Wayne South Bend Diocese for 28 years. 24 of those years as bishop, even in his final months, those who knew him say he gave his life to serve the poor and made this community better with his compassion and kindness toward people. Rather you're a Catholic or not, many would say Bishop John Darcy was a man of virtue. That very quality continues to change this community. Sunday was the 56th anniversary of his first mass as an ordained priest. Darcy was installed as the 8th bishop of the Fort Wayne South Bend Diocese in May 1985 and gave his last mass in January 2010. Bishop Kevin Rhodes recalls his final wish before his passing. A week ago, Bishop Darcy said that he wanted to die on uh, yesterday on Sunday because it was the day he celebrated his first mass as a priest and sure enough the Lord answered his prayer. He was known for supporting or starting some organizations in the community such as the Women's Care Center and Matthew 25 Health Clinic among others. This showcased Bishop Darcy's heart was for the poor. Deborah Schmidt remembers when she was appointed by Bishop Darcy as the executive director of the Catholic Charities. He said he had the faith in me, and I thought, well, um, I guess I can do it. Bishop Darcy had the same faith in Kathy Denise. He appointed me to the board of directors of Catholic Charity, and that's where my passion started for Catholic Charities. Loving, kind, gentle, words people use to describe Bishop Darcy's heart for mankind and characteristics they hope others will carry on, making this a better place to live. And funeral arrangements have been finalized. Bishop Darcy's viewing will be Friday morning from 9 until 11.30. Then his funeral will begin at noon. This will all take place at the Cathedral of Immaculate Conception in Fort Wayne. A reception will, be, will happen afterward at the Grand Wing Center. In Studio 15 tonight, Lamar Holiday, News Channel 15. 